3 times 3 eyes in Japanese, is a manga series written and illustrated by Yuzo Takata. It was serialized in Kadansha Zain and Manga Magazine's Young Magazine Keizokuban and Weekly Young Magazine from 1987 to 2002, spanning to a total of 40 volumes. The English language translation was published by Dark Horse Comics, but was discontinued after the release of Volume 8 in 2004. The manga has received two original video animation series based on 3 times 3 eyes that were released in 1991 and 1995 and cover the storyline up to Volume 5 of the manga. The first consisted of four episodes averaging to half hour of runtime and the second consisted of three averaging out to 45 minutes of runtime. In the United States, the first OVA was originally distributed by Streamline Pictures and the second was distributed by Manga Entertainment shortly after the Japanese releases. The two OVAs were later re-released in 2001 by Pioneer Entertainment in a collected set. The series has also received several companion books, drama CDs, and video games, only released in Japan. In 1993, Three Times Three Eyes won the Kadansha Mango Award for the Shonen category. Three Times Three Eyes follows the adventures of Pai, the last remaining Sanya and Ankara, and her new Wu. Yakumo, as they desperately try to find a way to make Pai human so that she can forget her troubled past. Pai traveled to Tokyo searching for the artifact, but shortly after she arrived, a thief snatched her backpack and cane from her. A teenage lad, Yakumo, tackled the crook and managed to get the pack back for her though the thief escaped with the cane. Yakumo took her to his work, where Pai was ill to get cleaned up, and where she discovered that he was the son of Professor Fuji, an archaeologist she had met in Tibet four years prior. The professor had been researching the legends of the Sanyans and had befriended her and offered to help her find the Ningen, only to fall ill and die. Pai had his last letter to his son in her backpack, which asked Yakumo to help Pai with her quest. Although he didn't believe his father's tales of Pai being a monster, he agreed to assist her. Their discussion was interrupted by news reports of a giant monster flying over the city. Pai recognized the creature as her pet Takui, who must have been released from his home and Pai's came by the thief, and who was now looking for her. Pai set out to retrieve him, with Yakumo close behind. However when Yakumo saw Takui fly towards Pai, the lad mistook the beast's welcome for an attack, and shoved Pai out the way, immediately Takui ripped into the lad, fatally wounding him. Unwilling to lose the boy she had been hunting for and just located, Pai's third eye opened, and she absorbed his soul. This restored his body, but tied him to her as her undead servant. Linked to her, he can only become human again when she becomes human. In the way of this goal are hordes of monsters and demons from the shadow world, some desiring Pai's powers, others who seek the Ningen for their own. Yakumo can again become mortal and end his constant need to protect Pai because if Pai dies, then so will he. Along the way, they encounter many followers of the now-dead demon god Kain Wang, all of whom wish to kill Pai or siphon off her power in order to resurrect their deity and or gain immortality. Three Times Three Eyes is written and illustrated by Yuzo Takata. It was first published for five chapters in Kadansha's young magazine Keizokuban from December 14, 1987 to April 10, 1989, and later serialized in Weekly Young Magazine from 1989 to 2002. Kadansha collected its chapters in 40 Tankoban volumes, released from October 17, 1988, to November 6, 2002. A limited edition of the final volume was released on the same day of the normal edition containing a video game for PC. Kadansha also released four special edition volumes. The first two were released on April 25, 2002. An additional box set was also released on the same day. The remaining two limited edition volumes were released on May 23, 2002. The manga was re-released into 24 volumes from August 12, 2009, to July 9, 2010. A limited edition of the final 24th volume was released on the same day as the normal edition containing a commemorative art book. The English language translation was originally published by Studio Proteus by Innovation Comics in 1991, but in 1995 was published from the beginning by Dark Horse Comics after they purchased Studio Proteus. As well as serialized in Super Manga Blast. Magazine. This release altered art to remove several instances of a penis-like tentacle emerging from a character's mouth in Volume 2, this censorship was done with the approval of Yuzo Takata. A total of eight volumes were published between March 1, 1995, and May 5, 2004. The manga was discontinued in 2005 before the release of the ninth volume. Sequels A manga sequel, titled Three Times Three Eyes, 
Jinju no Mori no Sonensha, began on young magazine Keizo Kuban Manga website on December 26, 2014. The manga finished in August 2016. A second manga sequel, titled Three Times Three Eyes, Kiseki no Yami no Keiakusha, started on December 22, 2016 on E Young Magazine Online Manga Magazine. In 2019, the manga was transferred to Monthly Young Magazine on February 20. The series entered its last stage in September 2021. Two original video animation series were produced by Toei Animation and its subsidiary Studio Junio. The first shares the same name of the manga and released four episodes between July 25, 1991, and May 19, 1992. The second OVA titled, Three Times Three Eyes, Legend of the Divine Demon is the sequel to the first with a total of three episodes released between July 25, 1995, to June 25, 1996. A four-disc Blu-ray box set was released on August 4, 2010. The first two discs contained episodes from the two OVAs, respectively. The additional other two discs are soundtrack from the OVAs. The first OVA was originally dubbed and distributed in the United States by Streamline Pictures in 1992, featuring Eddie Frierson as Yakumo and Rebecca Forstad as Pi. Instead of four episodes, the Streamline version comprised two parts that merged the first and second episodes and the third and fourth episodes. The second OVA was originally dubbed and distributed by Manga Entertainment in 1995, with Frierson and Forstad reprising their roles. Manga's release was treated as a continuation of the streamlined version and thus referred to the three episodes as the third, fourth, and fifth parts as opposed to the fifth, sixth, and seventh episodes. In 2001, the two OVAs were re-released in the United States by Pioneer Entertainment. The Pioneer release included a new English dub that retained the original episode count and starred Brigitte Bako as Pi and Christian Campbell as Yakumo. Directed by Greg Weissman, the dub also featured Keith David, Bill Fogerbaki, Tom Adcox Hernandez, and Asner, who all previously appeared with Baco in Weissman's series Gargoyles, and the dub contained homages to the series. Three Times Three Eyes Legend of the Divine Demon 3 drama CDs have been released by King Records. The first is titled Three Times Three Eyes Ten no Maki and was released in Japan on September 5, 1990. The drama CD titled, Three Times Three Eyes Hido no Maki was released in Japan on November 21, 1990. The third drama CD titled, Three Times Three Eyes Chi no Maki was released in Japan on June 23, 1993. Music for both anime OVA series were composed by Kaoru Wada and primarily performed by a group known as Takata Band. All soundtracks were released under its Star Child label. For the original OVA, a total of four soundtracks were released. The soundtrack titled, Three Times Three Eyes, Daiichi Shu was released in Japan on August 21, 1991. The second soundtrack titled, Three Times Three Eyes, Daini Shu was released in Japan on November 21, 1991. The third soundtrack titled, Three Times Three Eyes, Daisan Shu was released in Japan on April 22, 1992. The fourth soundtrack titled Three Times Three Eyes Takata Band was released in Japan on June 24, 1992, and contains tracks primarily performed by Takata Band. For the second OVA, Three Times Three Eyes, Legend of the Divine Demon, two soundtracks have been released. The first soundtrack titled, Three Times Three Eyes, Legend of the Divine Demon, Descendant Musical Terminal was released in Japan on July 5, 1995. The second soundtrack titled, Three Times Three Eyes, Legend of the Divine Demon, Descendant Musical Terminal 2 was released in Japan on June 5, 1996. Kaoru Wada's theme song Pai Longing appears on Three Times Three Eyes, Daichi Shu. Several reviewers have noted its resemblance to James Horner's theme song to the later 1995 Hollywood film Braveheart. Various video games came out based on the Three Times Three Eyes manga and OVA. Two video games were developed for the Super Famicom. The first titled, Three Times Three Eyes Sima Karin Den was developed by Yutaka and released on July 28, 1992. The second titled, Three Times Three Eyes Juma Hokan was developed by Ban Presto and released on December 22, 1995. A video game for the Sega Mega CD titled, Sima Densetsu Three Times Three Eyes MCD was developed by Sega and released on July 23, 1993. Nihon Create had developed three games for the Three Times Three Eyes and ported to several consoles. The first video game developed by Nihon Create titled, Three Times Three Eyes Sanya and Henjo was released on PC 9801, FM Towns, PC Engine, Windows 3. 
1, and Windows 95. The second video game developed by Nihon Create titled 3x3 Eyes Kusei Koshu was released on Windows 95, PlayStation, and Sega Saturn. The third video game developed by Nihon Create titled 3x3 Eyes Tenrin O Genmu was released on Windows 95, Windows 98, Windows 2000, Windows XP and PlayStation. The three games were collected in a four-disc DVD box set titled 3x3 Eyes Memorial on December 13, 2002. Several companion books have been released for 3x3 Eyes manga. The first is titled 3x3 Eyes, Yoma Dezuken and released on April 24, 1998. The book features character and monster encyclopedia, commentary, crossword, stickers, and a short story titled Haihaku Suru Yoma by Endo Akinori. A second book titled 3 Times 3 Eyes Another World was released on April 1, 2001. It contains a special talk with Endo Akinori and interviews with the characters Pai and Yakumo. An anthology book titled 3 Times 3 Eyes Another Story was released on March 23, 2000, and contains short stories written by Endo Akinori. Katsumi Isizuka, and Kusuno Shinichi. A papercraft book titled Three Times Three Eyes, Yoma Ritai Zukan was released on May 24, 2000. A book titled Three Times Three Eyes, Perfect Didin was released on April 6, 2001. The German digital hardcore group Atari Teenage Riot used audio samples from the streamlined English dub of the first episode of Three Times Three Eyes in their song Start the Riot, released on the compilation album Burn, Berlin, Burn. In 1997, Alec Empire of Atari Teenage Riot also used samples from the first and second episodes of the streamlined dub on his 1996 solo album The Destroyer. As of February 2015, Three Times Three Eyes had over 33 million copies in circulation. In 1993, the manga won the Kadansha Manga Award for Shonen. The OVA adaptation had received mixed to positive reviews. Theron Martin of Anime News Network praised both OVA stating while not a spectacular series, 3 Times 3 Eyes is nonetheless a very solid production which should entertain those who don't mind high levels of bloodshed and rampant mystical content. Justin Savakis also of Anime News Network, criticized the art style the animation quality of the series, whilst noting that the series is still entertaining. Carlos Ross of them Anime Reviews praised the first OVA for its animation and characters, but criticized the story for its disjunctive nature and anticlimactic ending. For the second OVA, Ross gave the plot a mixed review noting that it is more coherent than the previous OVA, but also more confusing. Stig Hogsett also of them Anime Reviews, gave both the OVAs a more positive review, praising the characters and artwork, but criticizing the ending for it feeling unfinished. Luis Cruz from Mania, gave the first OVA a mixed review stating, 3 times 3 eyes has the material to be a classic series, sick, however, the OVA format limits. Its potential by constraining the amount of time it can spend building the characters and their world, he continued to state for the second OVA. It only falls short by being hobbled with a story arc conclusion rather than a proper ending and the story stands well enough on its own and provides nearly two hours of action, humor, and intriguing mysteries. Thanks for watching.